Good day everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a new let's play of a very highly modded Skyrim. So, since Oblivion broke, I really wanted to do Skyrim, I guess, because you know I'm not gonna start that from scratch. Uh, and since I have a much better PC, I can actually use very good quality, high quality visual mods and whatever, so I'm really excited for that. I do have also installed the uh, huge um, quest mods, I guess, like Falskar, Worms Tooth, Legacy of the Dragonborn, stuff like that, so that will be fun to do. Um, yeah, anyway, let's just start the game. I'm not using a webcam right now, as you can probably tell by not my face not being here on the screen, mainly because it's freezing once I start the game, which is weird. I mean, my webcam freezes, so I don't know why that is, so we'll figure it out. Maybe I'll show my face on Skyrim one day, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I haven't thought about who I want to play as, actually. Um, last time I played as a Nord, kind of thinking I maybe want to be a Breton to use spells, although a um, High Elf could be fun too. Huh. I know I'm boring, maybe a Wood Elf. First of all, I will change m my gender, okay. Um, how do I zoom in a little bit? Let's see. Oh, the red card looks nice. Hello there. I already was a Nord, so I'm not gonna do that. Honestly, I have no idea. And what? I'll be a Breton. She looks nice. She she looks cute. Sure, why not? Um, I guess I'll keep this preset, maybe. Oh, she looks like she rolled around in a pile of dirt. Um, she looks a little bit mad. Um, oh, well, it goes for a second. She kind of looks nice. I like whoa whoa god. I like this one's hair actually. I might not even change it to be honest. But um nah I don't like her face so This kind of looks like a good starting face, I guess. I have no idea to be honest. Watch me spend five hundred hours creating my character, which whose face we will rarely see. Um okay war paint. Do I want to add some war paint? Hmm. I mean, this kind of looks nice. If I made it darker. Oh, let's make it purple, blue, or whatever. Sure, why not? Um, I can make... Uh, I can give her elf ears, so that's nice. You know what? Might as well do that. Let's make her a half-elf. I like that. Let's see the nose. I don't even know what to do. Make it a little bit longer, proportion-wise. I guess that's good. I don't know. Don't really care as much. She looks kind of good, I guess. Eye color. Ooh, I have a lot of eye mods. 114 different eyes. That looks nice, but... Ooh, those look nice. I feel like I might want to use the glowy eyes. Hmm. Glowing green eyes. These ones look nice. Nah, but do they? I don't even know. Kind of like the ones at the end. Do really like the glowy ones, but these looks look nice. I guess I'll go with these ones. Um, eyeliner color. I'll um black. I guess can't really see it because of the word paint. So, um, eyebrow. Surprisingly, I guess I like this one. Mouth shape. Probably will use the third one, although if I lower this one, maybe. I guess it can work with it. And I really enjoyed that hair, but I kind of want. Is it uh, maybe white gray? I don't even know. 
Yeah, sure. Action, uh, not gonna add anything. And since I suck naming my characters, I just googled the list of female Britain names in the Elder Scrolls games. So I'll name her Senna. Oh, I can't write apparently. Don't mind me. Okay. All of the menus are registering. Wish she looks nice. Let's see. Approach my child and choose where your new life shall begin. When I was testing the game, I would go for the surprise me thing, and let's do that actually. Unless, unless it's uh, the stormcloak beginning, which then I will reload because um, I don't want that. I already went with the stormcloak last time, so you know. So be it. I want more variety on my channel. Channel in that sense, so you know. I want the Imperials. Mm -hmm. This time around, I'm I'm gonna side with them. Really like these loading screens. They look nice. Where the hell am I? No. I see snow. Ice. It feels like I'm on a steep hill. Oh my god, look how beautiful it looks, doesn't it? Like, I just can't... I can't... Let's see, my configuration, I have to... I don't know why Immersive HUD is not working for me. I have the... Uh, what's the UI mod called? I forget, but like... I don't know, maybe they don't like working together. So, um... Oh, look, I'm in Soul's time! <laughs> oh my god! Okay... I'm too low leveled to start. Um, uh, let's read this. To start the Dragonborn DLC quest line, so. I literally have mining clothes. Someone's looking for you in White Run. Well, I have to get my ass to White Run somehow. A sacrifice. This tells me I shouldn't be spending time in this place. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Where is Raven Rock? The Raven. Um. Oh, I can actually fast travel to Skyrim, can I? <laughs> Look, I guess I'll do that. Since, I mean, I'm afraid of traveling weaponless. You know what I mean? Quite honestly, maybe I should actually join the. Captain Gallen does the business around here. I'm just a ship's mate. Join the. the um... Imperial Legion. Do any of these boats? Don't know what freedom re the North Wind is my oh, I shouldn't have skipped his dialogue. I forgot master. how to play I don't this game. I don't tolerate any disloyalty. You looking for work? Got a sailor who thought running a gang of thieves would be more money than hauling my cargo. You make an example well, of that good. gang. I'll give you a year's worth of pay. They're as good as dead. The heart's the spirit. Right. See you round. Is that a chicken? What the hell is that? I see a wolf. Is that some kind of... What, what the hell is that? I'm not going to even go and check. Um... Oh, you're a boat guy. Of course. You can hire a boat? Yes. Where are you headed? Solitude, nice. You think yeah. I do this for my health? Come back when you've got the coin. I'm poor. I don't have anything to sell. I could try stealing oh. stuff. What kind of fight? Who's fighting? Or are they all attacking that wolf? I'll just quietly out this. leave. Because again, I'm weaponless. What a start. Also, I have notice boards, which is nice. So, um, we'll have some random quests we can do, you know, for gold and whatever. Am I going the correct way? I don't even know. Oh! Hi, lady! Would you like to buy some flowers? Please? I don't have any money, and sorry, not right now. Oh. I... Okay. Sorry. Jeez. Like, I kind of feel bad for her, but like... Mm. I'm poor. <laughs> I don't even have a weapon, so... Can't do anything. Please, okay. Won't you buy a flower? Oh, just stop following me! Gosh. And what might you need? Hmm. 
Let's get the hell out of this city, I guess. Racist Nords, of course. Oh, it wouldn't be Windhelm without them. Now against I don't have any gold. A part of me wants to try and steal a weapon or something, cause like, um... Obviously the smart route would be to join the, the Legion. Cause they would give me a sword, I think, right? An Imperial sword at least, so that's something. Um, but like... Do I have a lockpick? Let's try picking this lock. You're out of lockpicks. Why did I think I have... My horses are broken, broken it seems. I'll have to fix that after this episode. Probably somehow, right? Because that does not look nice. Let's check the map. So, um... Solitude is over there. And that is quite far away. Wreck of the Winter War. Tun Tundra Homestead White Run. I have no idea where I want to go. Maybe let's mark White Run, I guess. Just to have a general sense of direction. But like, um, what a magnificent first episode. One mod is already broken. Like, it wouldn't be me if it was working, right? <laughs> um, and uh, I have no weapons. Basically, I'm an NPC, to be honest, because like, Ooh, I see something over there. Maybe I can steal stuff. I guess I'm going with the thief route. Fishing supplies. Yeah, must have a fishing rod. I don't have that. I thought these were fishes that I could steal, but... Oh, look, salmon. <laughs> what will I do with that salmon, you might ask? I don't know. I might eat it. I might sell it. I might use it as a... I'm not gonna end that sentence. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's just amazing to walk through a highly modded Skyrim, I guess, because the amount of different modded versions of Skyrim you could make, like, completely different looking games, you know, when I think about it, so every modded version is very, very unique, and I like that. What is over there? Oh god, is that a wolf? And my game decided to freeze a little bit. Kynes Grove? Oh, Kynes Grove, huh. Good to have you on my map, I guess. Oh, maybe if there was an axe or something, jeez. I guess I'll try to steal from the end. Hopefully they'll have a we weapon or something. Welcome. Let me know if you want anything. I think I got a clean mug around here. Okay, I'm hidden. Raw beef. Sack of flour. I like these benches, they look like crates. Um, don't mind me, I'm just looking around your home. Not your home, you're in. I am stupid today. Let's see. Oh, it's empty. Oh my god. I probably won't find any. Oh, I see a sword. A dagger. Okay, great. It'll have to do for now. <laughs> oh my god. Um, okay, the fire is working nicely. I didn't check the ends, actually. Once I added my embers and inferno mats. Anyway, I'm blabbering. Let's equip the dagger. Finally, we have some kind of weapon. Looks nice, doesn't it? Uh, different from the regular steel daggers. Honestly, I don't know why I'm bitching about weapons when I can use spells. Damn, I'm not working today. Let's favorite these. And we can use them. We'll do some conjuration spells, maybe. Look. You look very fluffy. Where is he? I wonder if my difficulty is on adept. I should check that.
because it feels kind of too easy right now. System settings, gameplay. Oh, oh my god, that okay, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I was like, why is it so easy? Because like I'm basically weaponless, you know what I mean? A wolf belt, I guess I'll take them. I can make some gold off of them. And I guess I'll keep... I'll continue conjuring my familiar as much as I can. Okay. There's no road sign, I don't even know if I'm... I guess let's go that way. Just to raise my skill a little bit. Okay, so I should probably make my way to White Run... Uh, not to White Run, to Riverwood actually. To the standing stones. Cause like... You know, a boost... Oh, there's a giant over there. I will not fight him. Don't even know where the hell I am to be honest, but it looks beautiful so... Makes up for it. And also, I feel like if I check out Helgon I might find some stuff so... You know... Ah, the weather looks nice. Haven't checked this place out yet either when I was testing the game. Oh look, a chest! Oh, lucky me. A battle axe. I'll take it. One thing <laughs> that's kind of broken is the potions. They look awesome, you know, in-game, but like they're huge. So, um, I don't know. Okay, have some gold. Hey, yeah, that is nice. Oh, a sword? And the water. That looks very, um... Dramatic and you know, it reminds me of like Scalibur or whatever. No, am I mixing weapons? Up? Poison, something's attacking me. Oh, shoot! Wrong one. Oh, okay, great. You'll see me burn. Shoot! Oh god, this is not fun. Well, I guess I'll use the minor magic potion. Magic for that, huh? Breathe in, fight him. Quickly kill him before the. Oh. Okay. Guess I'll take anything that's worth anything. He'll be naked where her ashes. Cause like um. I guess I just need money. An ancient Nord sword. Oh, and the shield, you know what? Let's see. Do that, favorite it. Do the shield. For now, at least. That's an empty dragger. Check out this guy. Another conjure. Okay, I will have some things to sell. So, that's great. Probably won't have enough gold to actually buy an armor set, but um... Look at me, I'm moving up. I found a shield, I found a better weapon, so that's nice. Honestly, I would like a bow. But I feel like I won't be able to find it as quickly for some odd reason. I see wolves. Uh, do I want to fight them? Probably not. I guess I don't mind, but... Like, the amount of lag the first playthrough of Skyrim I did on this channel had, you know, it wasn't that bad, but it was annoying at times, so it's really nice to play it like this, you know, without 
Edgar lag the hut, so... Where am I? Hell knows. This is some kind of mill, I'm assuming. Oh, I know this place. Not Angus Mill, no. Mo moon? Something with the moon? No? I guess we'll find out soon enough. You! The one whom the prophecy speaks of! It is you! Come hither, chosen one! I must lay my eyes on you! I don't know who you are. I'm listening. I am your Groshak, a member of an ancient orcish cult by the name of Orsinium Vero. For the longest time, we, the voices of Orsinium, have trekked throughout Tamriel in search of support for our cause. A moment is all I ask. Fine, how can I help? Such enthusiasm can only be envied. What a pity that all of this was no more than a great diversion. Tie her down, lads! But be careful, it's not a yam sack. What the hell is happening? I know I have quest Fine. mods. But like, what the hell is happening? <laughs> I'm too low leveled for this shit, like I'm level 1. Wake up, you scum! I can't even see in this freaking place. Amulets are on your necks. Pray that you aren't <sighs> sold to a local. Every N1 Sadrath Kegran has their tongue cut out. Lest they ask one too many questions. Now get out of the cage and follow me. Take your places on the counter and don't make a sound. I like the Mario in the music, but like what the hell is happening? <laughs> <laughs> what, the, what? Why am I? What? The, what? what the, I feel like I'm drunk walking, but. Ooh. I hope everybody can see you. I'll try to raise the brightness actually in these places where it's really dark, you know? But, but, but in both processing, I guess. I don't know. But, um. Looks cool. I don't even know which mod started right now, but like, you'd think it wouldn't One start so soon now, shut up. Come closer, closer, take a gander at our latest merch. Basically, I'm being sold in yeah. Sorcerer. Yeah. Don't forget right. about the Red Oran. They only want Khajiit. First off, the auction. With a peculiar peck, I present lot number one. A vampire! We begin the bid at 500 septum. Which one's the vampire? Six! 600! More offers! Six going once, going twice! Six! Can I get a seven? Sold to Master Selfry for 600 septums! An nice excellent nice. purchase, Master Selfry. Lot number two! A young female Argodian, freshly plucked from the Windhelm docks, bid begins at 450 gold! 800 septums. Whoa! That's quite a bid from Sergio Berendez! 850 gold! Anyone to beat? Any other offers? Nine. 1,100. Lot number two, 1,100 septums, going once, going twice, who's more, sold for a sum of 1,100 septums to our splendid guest, Sergio Verandez. Sorry, well Tamina, but I'm in nice desperate way. need of a new handmaid. Swiftly moving on. Lot number three, a middle-aged lizard, harvested from the woods of Falkry, starting bed at 500 Harvested, septums. I don't like how he's... <laughs> Surely this item piques the interest of one of you fine folk. No offers for such a shining old specimen? A shame. Please remove lot number three from the auction. That was quick. He is going to make a good pass. a good lizard. Which one are they going to kill this guy? 
Well, I feel bad for him, but... Okay, you're taking your time, you know? Everybody's t- On to lot number four! A half-breed! Not man, not mer, but slave! Designed for house duty! Or guard fodder, either one! Three hundred? Are you talking about 400, me? Five hundred? Six hundred and fifty septums! Seven hundred? A thousand septums! Two thousand septums! This is steel. Any last offers? Who's more? Final call. This is your last chance. If it's me, at least I'm kind so, of expensive. <laughs> oh god, but this is I how will I ask you? Yours. You will serve me well, and what? I will not. Stupid of you to think that. I will find a way to escape. Where the hell am I? My head is spinning, I can barely see if there's a light or something. I see you are awake. Great, we have time for a little chat. I'm listening. You're the one who wants to talk to me and you're... And who are you? Magister of House Telvani, renowned scholar, author of a myriad of works on ritual semantics. And your rightful master, Shernath Selfry. Where's that damn orc? His name is Yago Groshak, or Shaglak. Not that damn orc! From now on, you will address him with due respect. He said they would cut out our tongues. Yes, they did cut them off. All but yours. I had no need for a typical Enoir. Only good for scut work and pleasures of the flesh. I was in need of an assistant who'd help me with my work and small talk with his Dunma on my behalf. Do you even know who I am? No idea. Do pray tell. Uh, on second thought, you'd rather not. Henceforth, you are a blank slate. You will not utter a word of your past. Oh God, where am I? Uh, in a cage, I suppose. It's your home from now on. For a broader perspective, you are in Sadrith Kegra, a secret outpost of House Telvani in Skyrim. House Telvani? Read. If you cannot, take this one as well and you'll learn. ABCs for barbarians, goddamn. Uh, and what am I supposed to do now? Have I answered all of your questions? Not remotely, but... What now? There are a few rules you must follow before I set you free. What? From now on, ah, you are forbidden to leave Sadrith Kegra till you get your freedom. You can go wherever and do whatever. As long as it's within the settlement. You are not allowed to talk about your past. If you hold the desire to end someone, you will find yourself incapable. You will tell me nothing but the truth. This doesn't apply to others. That's it, I think. Your amulet is now attuned and won't let you get loose. Get out of your cage and go take a look around. No, this take is a fun walk start. Walk around the city, chit chat with a local riffraff. But don't loiter too long. You have work to do. <sighs> How do I exit this cage? What's in here? Village white wine. I need that. 
I'll drink myself to sleep today. An apple and bread. And some cheese. Why do I have a skull in my cage? I have no idea. Well, at least I can take stuff from him, and I will. Interesting how I can take certain things and others are stealing. Sadrif Kegran, a brief history part one. Is it long? Probably is. If you want to read it, do pause the video. Probably is interesting. I'll sell it because it's expensive. Common stitched boots. Common cuffed boots. A torture tool, really? Ugh. Usually I'm one to try out ingredients, you know, but like... I mean, I don't even have that amulet equipped, so... <laughs> Sex to be that guy. I look like a prisoner. In a sense, I am. Well, I actually am a prisoner. I mean, one handed increase. Nice. Oop. Well, he didn't see me steal, so. Sealed spell of alteration. Hanging gardens. Sealed spell of restoration. I mean, since nobody can see me. Can I use them somehow? Can I learn them, I should say. Let's see, ABC is for Barbarian. A is for Achenac. B is for Bungler's Bane. C is for Comberry. And that's all? <laughs> how am I supposed to learn how to read with literally three letters? Huh. Can't use them, so... Oh my god, that's an expensive book. He shouldn't have left me alone. In this place. Because, like... I am going to go wild. On his items. His books, his whatever. Let's see. There we go. Where is the exit now? Here? Um. Well, it is night time. Project Project A A H O A Ho I don't know. Looking for last freedom. Um. No, let's try waiting a little bit. Mainly because I'm hoping it will become brighter once it's you know daytime. Because that's how ENBs work, weirdly enough. One more hour. I guess me, I don't even know to be honest. Um, I'm supposed to return to him. I no map markers, huh? Is he inside? It's kind of annoying having to be. Oh, a staff. I have a weapon. Which I apparently, in his words, cannot use. Where is he? Oh, here he is. Oh, do you yeah. do you not see me steal stuff once? I, oh. Out with it! Any work for me? You don't seem to be in a hurry, Enwa. I'm not. Firstly, pick up my stuff from Varun the Smith. 
Can the casual stumble across Murano? Tell him I have no time to inspect his project. Here's a coin purse to pay for the job. Where can I find this Baron? He's working the forge most of the time. You'll find it with ease. Just look for the sign. It might be worth a check at the inn, too. Who's Morano? Rodan's empty-headed son. He wanted me to take him on as an apprentice. His father was against it, and now he's nagging whenever he gets a chance. When I tell him that his son is Warneck of a scamp, there's no point in teaching him. Varun doesn't like it any better. When will you let me go? Never. Yes, that's clear. Are you for the stone cloaks or the legion? That's the question. Oh, Kagranak, who these be? I hold no interest in any sort of moronic nought, nor imperial conflict. What can you tell me about this place? What? This place? The place where you are standing this very moment. Well, it is relatively flat. Doesn't wobble, doesn't crumble. Have I answered your stupid question? Where am I? Sadrith Kegra. I've told you that already, you slackwit! <laughs> oh, I have a lot of work to do, don't bother me. Oh, I'll bother you and annoy you. Shouldn't have bought me. I'm the most annoying person you'll ever meet. Let's see. Retrieve Shanna's staff from Varen. Let's do that, I guess. Annoying as it is, I somehow have to get my freedom back, so... I mean, this place looks nice, actually. Huh. Let's play in third person for a little bit. Didn't do that the first time around, so... My god. Ooh! A mud crab! A friendly mud crab, who are you? What now? Give me your armor. <laughs> I feel unsafe right now. Are uh, you over here? Bag yourself an armor weapon. Come on, don't be shy. Aye. This one needs something. I'm here to grab the staff for Shanath. Here's your order. Now give me the money and piss off to your master. Well, hello. So annoying. Not the Dragonborn yet, so I can't say I'm the Dragonborn and I'm doing stuff like this, but damn it. I'm a Breton of a noble lineage. And I'm doing stuff like this. Dang, I just wanted to join the College of Winterhold, you know. Learn some spells. No, but I'm have to... I have what your staff. You... I was thinking of buying a new wall already. Just hand me the staff. I will need it shortly. What now? Cleaning. Remember that vampire I bought alongside you? Turned out feeble. Kicked the bucket after the third experiment. I am so disappointed. Run to Tamina Elenium. The alchemist. Get chorus acid from her. It's already paid for. There's a barrel in your room. You will fill it with acid and dissolve that fetcher's corpse in it. What? Don't give me that look. Get down to work. Why don't we just bury it? Are you mad? If anyone finds out how often my inwife kiss stars goodbye, they'll stop selling them to me. No corpse, no questions. 
Now shoot. Where does Tamino live? A day's time is enough to visit every corner of this city ten times over. Ah, you head southwest. If you find a sign with a cauldron painted on it, that's the alchemy shop. But that's so cruel. Nothing of the sort. There's no use in him anymore. We need to get rid. What if we start to decay and stink up the place? Yes, yes. Oh god. Obtain Charas adds acid. From Tamila Eleanor, oh, no, I was drinking Sandy water, so sorry, I'm like, I can't read after I do that, apparently. <laughs> Yeah, this is a definitely an interesting way to start this let's play, but I guess I'm enjoying it, so that's nice. Let's go get that acid. I should tell everybody he's doing this, to be honest. Then he wouldn't be able to buy slaves. Part of me wants to... Check out the ENB settings. Make it a little bit brighter for the let's play, cause um, you know, I think you can see, but still. Potions, poisons, ointments. Don't be shy. Your choice is rich. Well, hello. I'm here to collect the Charis acid that Shanaf was asking for. Has this hapless scholar murdered someone again? And now he's trying to cover up the traces. Do you know anything about it? Everyone in Sadrith Kegra knows this. It's ridiculous how a pile of scrib jelly is trying to conceal the truth. He buys two or three Enwa at every auction. And the next week he goes shopping himself. All Enwa are dead by then. Here's your acid. Don't spill it. Fill the barrel, uh -huh. Um, where is this house? This place is new to me. I don't know where to go without map markers. <laughs> um, this way. This underneath the town. You mean in Balzac? Are you over no. here? Father strictly forbade me from stepping into that place in the world, but good. Oh, he's just walking around, huh? Annoying little man. Damn, the mud crabs look cute, actually. Aww. I want one for myself. The blue one, I want the blue one. Let's see, um... I'm supposed to fill some kind of bath? In his house? Oh, this barrel part- ooh. Ugh. Okay, come over here. Come on! Ugh. Um... I'll just... Okay. Ooh, does he have any available? He does. Another amulet. Except your father mentioned you once or twice. I think I guess I'll just make a shortcut for myself. Um What do you want? I finished the job. You didn't spill the acid, I hope. If you did, you'll have to scour it. I will deal with the barrel myself. Keep up the good work, and you won't have to buy acid for yourself. 
Maybe. Anything else? Yes, the results of my tea have come to an unfortunate end. <sighs> it's time to brew some new tea. Get it done? What sort of tea you want? What? You've been in the city for all this time and still don't know what tea your master likes? Outrageous! I should have boiled you in that barrel, along with the vampire. Get your lazy ass over to Tamina. <sighs> She'll give you the recipe. You are to gather the necessary ingredients, brew tea and fill some bottles with it. Ten should be enough. The amount of strength it's taking me to hold back from him, not killing him. I can't even- oh, I can't punch him. I swear to god. It's so annoying. If this quest line won't let me murder him, I will be so annoyed. Because that's literally the only thing I want to do right now. <laughs> I'm back. Well, hello. I need the recipe for Shanap's tea. Here you go. You will find all that is necessary at the farm. Can I offer my assistance with anything? What can you help me with? I don't know. As a matter of fact, I have got a task for you. Have you heard of Telvani Bugmusk? It's a very rare and expensive perfume. Highly prized throughout the Empire. Even a barbarian would be drawn to its fragrance. The idea of making it hit me recently. That's why I was in need of the scent glands of the Grayson bugs. By some miracle, Shaglak managed to get some for me. I'd like you to collect my order from him. The glands have been paid for. Will you help me? Sure, I'll do it. Thank you. I might even reward you with a sample of the perfume. Where can I get the ingredients for your tea? You can find Jasbe grapes in Sadrith Kegran. They grow underfoot. The rest can be found at the farm. Go to the inn, then take a right. A split will lead you to the mycelium. Then you'll have to find your own way to the farm. She's nice, actually. Is the tea really that horrible? I am not sure whether one would call it tea. It's a foul-smelling brew that makes Selthry feel enlightened, as he puts it. Ugh. As an alchemist, I can tell you with the utmost certainty that this is intoxication as opposed to enlightenment. See you. I guess that's all for now. Brew some tea. Um, so is it showing me? Um, I don't even remember. Oh, here we go. Two bees, two jasmine grapes, fly amanita, two pieces, thistle, one branch. Will I remember all of that? Yeah. Let's see. I guess I'll steal everything. Oh, death bells. Should I put some death bells into that tea? Is. I know she told me, but like, <laughs> I suck at navigating places like these. I guess I'll find it somehow. Mycelium. Should I go there? Maybe it'll have those mushrooms I need. Fly am in either right. Ugh. Let's see what's in here. A green apple. I'm 
mean? I feel like I might get attacked in this place. Oh, look, a helmet. A mace! I will beat his face in with that. Oh, the farm. Okay. Oh, wow. It's weird to actually be in a place that's bright. I guess we're looking for bees and whatever. What am I looking for? Bees, just bee grapes, fly a and thistle. some of this. Do I need more? Now I need to find some bees, thistle, and jazz bee. find them well for bees I'm assuming I need to find a beehive or something of the sort right which currently I can't see anything like that but um maybe we'll find it oh I found some thistle I think I needed one but juniper berries no I needed jasper Nightshade. Oh. I need a two bees, so potato plants. Do y'all have any grapes? Are they not grapes? Am I stupid? Uh, Jasper grapes, yes. Why did I think they were berries? <laughs> well, I mean, grapes are berries, but like. Uh, and why in a couple of days? Uh, painting will be ready. Wheat. A carrot. A cabbage. Snowberries. Juniper berries. I guess I have to still look around for the grapes. God dang it. I mean, it's refreshing to be in a place where I can see stuff, but, um. What's this? Alto wine strong. Whoop! God. <sighs> when you think this day can't suck more, you know I was kidnapped, sold, fell into a river. Ugh. Oh look, food. <laughs> I'ma steal all of it. A part of me wanted to actually um install the Damn it, I can't climb up there. A realistic needs mod. But I didn't want to make it too... Well, I can't really say difficult now, can I? But you know what I mean? But I think I could add it later on, right? So... Like, it's not much of a problem in a way. No, where could the grapes be? They're supposed to be here somewhere, right? Am I just too... Deathbed? 
Bells, Blister Ward. I swear to God. That also led to the farm, so... I'm spending too much time in this place. Maybe he'll have some grapes in his house. Bye. I have no idea, to be honest. <clears throat> Should I ask? Have you ever dealt with the amusing mud crab? Such a have you ever dealt with the amusing? See for yourself. Hopefully, I'll have some grapes. Not even she has, she has freaking clam meat, but she doesn't have I'll grapes. Take my meat, yeah, then. yeah. Farmhouse, maybe I can steal the grapes. I'm sure he won't mind. at this point. Lavender. I found lavender. I have freaking death bells everywhere. But no grapes. Mm -mm, nothing. Maybe the alchemist will have some. Hi there. Only fresh fruits and vegetables. Please tell me you have grapes. <sighs> he doesn't. He does not have grapes. I. I have no idea. Where does that lead to? Um. We need a key to open that, huh? Probably can escape through there. That's why they don't have a key or whatever. Or it's locked, I guess. Back into the darkness we go. Should I try the alchemist? She's literally my last chance. Where was she? Was she over here somewhere? I think so. Well, that seems like a alchemy shop sign. Oh, it's locked. Ah, let's see. 5 a.m., 6, 7, 8, 9. Let's do a bit longer and wait. Imagine my owner, Shannon, how annoyed he should be. Why is she not working? Because he sent me for tea and like I'm just wandering this place for days not finding grapes for his tea. Guess I'll wait another hour. Good morning. Hello there. You can find Jasbe grapes in Sedrith Kegren. They grow underfoot. The rest can be found uh... at the farm. I still don't know how I can find possibly find them, but um You really have to check every nook and cranny.
would have had any tea he wanted. But no, he had to choose the one with freaking grapes that are so rare. <sighs> Need something. Next time then. Grapes is what I need. I love the soundtrack because it's really giving me Morrowind vibes, but um. Oh, a chest. This will have some stuff to sell. I swear to God. She said they grow here. I have no idea how it even looks, you know what I mean? I'm looking for a bush with berries, I guess, but... <laughs> Nothing. <clears throat> so far, nothing. Hunting shop, I guess. Literally, what? I spent like 20 minutes looking for freaking grapes? Really? I'm assuming I spent that. Oh, God. I guess I'll, again, I'll enjoy the Maroon soundtrack and just shut up and look for those freaking berries. <sighs> Maybe I pick them up some. Do I have. Um... If I had them grape juice, you'd think since he has grape juice, he would have those grapes, right? In his house. <laughs> oh my god. You know what, I'll check his house out. Maybe he'll have some. I hope so. Human flesh. Ugh. Honeycomb. Did I read this? How dare you! Damn, he took a lot of things. Jazz be great. Okay. He took a lot of things from me. Is he taking back all of the what stuff that I. Do you want, Nothing. I want to brew your. Oh, shoot. I didn't. Oh, shoot. Finally. I have a mace in my ass, you know, yeah. like it. I'm not I'm ready to use Let it. Me taste. What the mace in my ass? Ooh, so annoying. Disgusting. Why are you standing on a chair? You call this tea? Are you trying to kill me? Go make some new right now. You will keep brewing until it is of adequate quality. Out of my sight! Return only when you have a decent brew! Oh hell no! Am I supposed to do that again? Yeah? My 
god. <laughs> Death. I need bees. Too bad I didn't take more. Seriously? Have to go back and get more bees? <sighs> have to go back to the freaking farm again? Where's the map? Let's see. Can I mark it? Too bad I can't mark it on the local map, you know what I mean? That's kind of annoying. Oh, hello. Yeah, hi. I'm just annoyed I cannot attack him like, you know... <sighs> this is awful. This place is awful. Can I do some parkour to be quicker? Haha! Look how quick I am on my feet. Take all the freaking bees. Might as well pick up more. Is there any thistle? Find it. Oh well. Oh, here we go. Okay, great. Let's try this again. Stupid me. I should have known. One batch of his awful tea would have been good. <sighs> yeah, walk, walk. You stupid son. <laughs> How about we go out for a short stroll outside? I'm assuming I might have to make it again. What would I need? I'm assuming grapes. Yes, grapes. I have enough grapes for one more. I ain't gonna go looking for more. Where is he? Where is my dumb master? Oh god. Where is he wandering around? Here's your tea. Ah, I hope you did everything right. Probably not. Oh, revolting! What a worthless NY you are! All right, we have no time for this. Go back to Tamina and grab some invisibility potions. I will be waiting for you near the entrance to Balzaf. 
That is slightly east of Sendu's house. With haste? I swear. Once I get an opening, I will run away. <laughs> this is awful. That man is awful. Need something? Yes. Hi there. Shanap needs invisibility potions. You know, I've got a strong feeling you're not the only one serving this elf. What do you mean? First tea, then acid. And now he wants me to hand him valuable goods. Just like that, I should say not. But surely he wouldn't have asked for them without reason, would he? I don't care about his reasons. Either he comes here himself and pays for the goods, or he goes without. Well... I mean, what did he expect, you know? I don't know, I'm just... I thought he paid for them. <laughs> to be honest, but it seems that he's not paying for anything. Um, so about the you potions. You don't seem to be in a hurry. Do you have the potions? First of all, I sprinted here. So don't you dare. I wasn't able to get the potions. Stupid Edwa! I can't rely on you to do anything! <sighs> Whatever. We are not vital. Now, let's get down to business. We are headed for Balzar. Once a city of talented scholars and skilled artisans. Dwemer vaults were only safe for the Dwemer themselves. Your top priority will be to protect me and provide me with assistance in case of unforeseen circumstances. But first I need to know your combat preferences. Sword or spell? <sighs> well, I would love to use spells, my magic and whatever is shitty. So I feel like a solid weapon will be, you know, safer. So I'll say I prefer weapons. So, you like swinging canes and what? What kind of weapon do you prefer? Again, I would love a bow and arrow, but I don't know what I'm going to be fighting, so I'll say something swift, one-handed. Take your armor and put it on. Let me know when you're done. Seriously, give me heavy armor? I guess I'll use the... Ugly helmet as well. Although since I'm wearing a mix, I could wear the dwarven helmet. Now that's a combination of armor. Sarah, Rajira wishes to speak with you. Who the, but the slaves here, they can't speak. It is true, but Rajira is an unusual case. Unusual and rare. Rajira was lucky enough to keep his dog intact. Literally, my master is listening five feet away. Aren't you afraid that I can reveal your secret to others? No one would trust you anyway. Rajira lives here for 15 years. Alright then, what did you want from me? Rajira is a trader. He sells information. Rajira would like to offer you his service. And what can Rajira tell me? Rajira sees many things. Things no one talks about. About local citizens. About Sadrit Kegran. For pity 20 coins, Razira will tell you something of interest. Sorry, but I'm not interested. It is fine, Mursera. Razira doesn't haste you. You'll come to Razira eventually. 
when you would talk to Rajira you. again, make sure no one would overhear you. Literally, someone who could overhear us is standing right here. Yeah? I'm ready. Stay close by and don't lag behind. I should just kill you in that place. No, nothing stopping me, to be honest. Ugh, these look like eyes. I don't like that. Hustle up. Well then, walk, goddamn. We need to go through the ancillary tunnels. After we descend, turn right. You have no business in the left wing. I do my best to avoid it. I don't even care what you do to avoid stuff. Our ultimate goal is the Dwemer Library. This engineering wonder is completely autonomous. Can you imagine? The library updates, sorts, and restores itself. All thanks to Animunculi. Hundreds of little mechanical spiders collect books. Scrolls and any knowledge that can be found on the surface. And bring them here, to Balzav. Interestingly, the spiders are unable to defend themselves. They do not even display aggression to strangers like us. <sighs> These canals most likely supplied water to the whole city. Try not to touch anything, and keep up. I could have sworn I had a different mod for Elven, so it's probably not. <sighs> the Lord. <Aha>! Oh! <laughs> Dang, you strong. Um. I wanted to see what kind of weapon that skeleton had, but um, hell knows where he is. Mind your step. Don't hit these pressure plates. They mean trouble. Really? If they killed you, would I be free? Because it's tempting for me to step on and even kill myself, to be honest. Time. Like hell? Do I care? On our way to the library, we will lock all the doors. Oh, both. Plus some half wit, like Baron. No dives into Balzarf and causes a blood. Ah! Yeah. Oh, shoot. This quest is too difficult for a little old level one me. <laughs> oh, that sword looks. Oh my god. I want a long sword like that. I don't have arrows, that would crash. That was not like that, but uh, I guess I'll be wearing heavy armor this time around. I have some healing potions. There we go. That did something, I guess.
he, he has some arrows. This one too. So that might prove useful. Let's do it like this. Should I go for the mace maybe? I feel like that's a little bit more useful than that sword. Careful! There are a lot of pressure plates ahead. Don't hit any. Yeah, you already said that. Not that stupid. Would construct oh god! I should be healing myself. Uh, I mean, oh, they're attacking him. Where's the little guy? Now run away! <laughs> Just don't have a shield. What was that? Oh, you're mine. oh God, no! Oh God, no! <laughs> I'm going to die. I'm so glad I'm not alone in this place because I would be so dead. Like, how far am I from? Le oh, I leveled up actually. Okay, let's, let's do some health right now. <laughs> um, damn it. Should I do destruction? I want spells. My sword is doing good enough damage. Or should I do restoration actually? Maybe. Let's do that. Might as well, you know. Use up less magicka when healing, right? I don't know why you bought me, like seriously, I'm the weakest person right now in the world of Skyrim. Like seriously. Oh god! Oh, okay. Again, what am I expect? I have no idea how am I going to go through all of this area? How am I going to, you know, become free again and whatever? Because I just, I can't. I have no idea which weapon I should use. The maze does more damage, but it's faster. This looks cool, it does a lot of damage, but it's slow, so I guess I should go for the sword, maybe. Let's conjure a familiar. Use dragon skin. Who's that? Come on, let's attack. I knew it. Yeah, I guess I'm going with the battle mage way this time around. There's no escape. 
Oh, don't you run away. You're like the powerhouse in this relationship. I didn't die this time around, so... <clears throat> oh, an ancient dwarven sword. Is it better than... It is. Looks nice, too. At least I'm finding some healing potions, so that's like very, very good. Well, need something? I'll take my leave then. No, you should lead the way. Behold the Etherium Abyss. Look, the spiders I told you about. They heed us no attention. Not a bother! <laughs> I doubt you've heard. What was that? Now you're mine! I like how instantly they defeat my familiar, you know what I mean? Oh, I shouldn't have attacked him, huh? Should I? Ooh! Well, he's not attacking me, so... That's nice. I'm taking all of these soul gems, yet I don't really need them right now, because I don't have an enchanted weapon. And I should try summoning my familiar as much as I can, I guess, to raise my conjuration. Hello? Damn, he has strong spells. I guess shock spell does so much. Dwarven dagger of burning. Oh, that might actually be quite useful. Apparently, I can carry a lot of stuff because so far, I'm just literally grabbing everything, and I'm like not overcumbered. Oh, huh. How's my conjuration doing? Is it nearing? Oh, oh, it's at twenty-five, huh? I see. I wish you would run, Shanath. Selfry, I wish you would run right now. I don't know what kind of sounds am I hearing. Are th is is that the spiders walking around? Because I feel like it's just centurions all around. And I don't like that. Great. But secret city. Its inhabitants were not involved in any conflict with the Normans, or rather Dwemer. Nor was Balzav impacted by the so called Etherian Wars. The study and extraction of Etherium ceased not until the Dwemer race. Oh, 
Ooh, stamina boots. Useful. Yes. And shovel yeah. here. I like how I'm the one who's supposed to be protecting him. Yeah. Yet, you know, I feel you see. All over now. At least it's a little bit brighter right now. <laughs> how far, do, how deep in the, to this place are we going, Selfie? Because, like, this is annoying. I know it's kind of my job to protect you right now. Well, it's not really my job, you're making me do it. You know? The abyss is a huge other of mine. For Dwemer learned to extract this mineral and make incredible things out of it. The denizens of Balzav could have conquered all of Tamriel with the power hidden within these depths. Fortunately, they had no such intention. The Dwemer had always been attracted to the unknown. And it certainly led them to there, I know. Still. Why are we going? Why are we here? You know what I mean? All I know is I'm supposed to protect him, which I can barely do because <laughs> I'm so freaking weak. I see an enemy. Okay. Come on, shoot your spark or whatever you're using. So what are we going to grab some ethereum? Huh? Now we're still going somewhere. There? Found at Hawk Peak. Okay. Great Hexagonal Library. Now that sounds interesting. Oh. 
I don't know if these are supposed to look like this, but because they look wrong. <laughs> like the mud is broken, you know what I mean? Compared to the other things. We have arrived. I will collect the books I need. Ah, here it is. The greatest of all known libraries. Ha, take it all in. Marvel. Okay. Am I supposed to go in through here? I can't fit. Let's try it this way. Hopefully nothing will jump out and attack me. I supposed to enter? Oh. Fast healing seems like a good spell to have. Damn, it's so hard to read certain books, I guess, so... Again, I have no idea where I'm going. Let's see, let's do Magicka now. I'll focus on my health and magic, I guess. Conjuration, let's do Destruction. I guess I'll be putting the other point probably, maybe, in Conjuration, we'll see. Is this where I'm supposed to be? Okay, what kind of books am I supposed to find? Cause like, Jesus of Tamriel maybe? King Edward? Houses of Morrowind. The Skald King. I have no idea. Kagranax tools. Is he hiding? I guess I have to try to talk to him because I have no idea what kind of books he wants. Watch him yell at me once I ask that. And where is he? Are you looking I for any books in particular? Day. Yeah, I'm talking over you even. What's my business? Make yourself useful. What are these Dwemer spiders doing here? Are you not paying attention? Ah, I will skip your dialogue. scrolls and books from the surface and bring them here. Okay, now I'm even more confused. Oh, he had... He gave me a list. He gave me a list, everybody. Fellowship of the Temple, Erver Mulo. Holidays of the Iliac Bay. On Mara's Tear. Oh, I saw those books. Is never uh, I 
I swear to God. <sighs> this place is actually really big. I feel like I'm walking in a circle because <laughs> I can see him. Now I feel like an idiot. Where was the entrance to the central library? Over here somewhere, I think. Don't let me take off my shitty. Helmet. It's not shitty, but it doesn't look as good as other armor pieces do, I guess. Oh, here we go. Okay, let's see. Fellowship of the Temple, Holidays of the Iliac Bay, and Mara's Tear. Fellowship of the Temple. Story of Lorisius. <laughs> At least my skills are leveling up. Because I really need that badly, to be honest. I, kn I know I picked up some of the books, but. Um... I saw those books, so where the hell are they? Do I need to take all of them? Fellowship of the Temple, okay, we got that. All's left is holidays, something, something. Oh, of the Iliac Bay, okay, great. And Mara's Tear. Am I going to take all of the books? Yes, because I don't know. I feel like the books that are laying under other books are glitching out and I can't take them. Some of them at least. Oh, Mara's here. Finally. he was here. Oh, he's over here. Out with it. I was able to gather all the necessary books. Fine. Do you remember the way back? Get all this junk to the city and give it to the customers. I have to stay a while. And keep hold of these books. You will hand them to me later. I'll take my leave then. Like I care. Well, I'm guessing I'll have to sprint the hell out of here. I'm assuming we dealt with all of the d uh, dwarven enemies. But you know, you can, you can never know. Is Selfry still in the library? And who are you? Ha! And why does it not surprise me that you've never heard of me? Allow me to introduce myself. Yen Ilu, Magister of House Selvani. You serve Shanaf, then. This role doesn't suit you for some reason. I'll ask again. 
is Shanaf in the library. What in oblivion is that? What are you doing here, Yen? Spying on us? No time for this. Better you tell me what the sp is going on. A library spider tried to snatch my book away from me. I sent the bugger on its way. What else do you think I should have done? You're even more stupid than I thought. Hey, you! Come here and ready your weapon or whatever it is you've got. It's about to get hot. I am weak. I'll die. Stay alive, it says. Really? Can I run away? Oh god! How am I supposed to stay alive? <laughs> Oh gosh. I don't have no shield, I have nothing. I see a big one. Oh, oh god. Now that's something else. Should I try and hit him? Ugh, I'm on fire. Y'all could see my face right now. They're coming, Jeeps of somebody, you can kill them. I'll just stay away. My familiar is doing stuff, so I'll let him do stuff. See, he's not doing much damage, but he's helping out. Good boy. He's a good boy. Right, you're a good boy. Yes, you are. Now the big ones come. I'll let them deal with them. The most I can do is summon stuff. Do I have... I don't have a magic potion, so... Um, how much help does he have? I'm afraid to get close to him. My magic is regenerating very, very slowly. And I don't like that. My damage. You dare Kinda wanna check how much health he has. Oh! Ah! Oh gosh! <laughs> oh god! He was almost dead! No! Seriously? How the hell did he even hit me? I'll just wait then. Seriously, I am going to stand here and wait while they kill him because I am too weak. I am too weak. If oh look, he dealt with him. Uh, they dealt with him quickly. Take his dynamo core. Prowler's Ethereum Core. Unprecedented foolishness. All of us could have perished because of your greed. Don't talk caution with me. Yet. I'm standing with him. It's no secret that these ruins are a danger. We have avoided this danger for nearly 150 years. Unimportant. You weren't invited here. 
Go sit in your fly-blown Sophia and don't pry into other people's business. We're leaving. You are leaving, but I still have a couple of questions for your companion. Don't you dare tell him a thing, else I'll boil you alive. Firstly, I'd like to get to know a bit more about you. Who are you? Shanna forbade me to talk about my past. A pity, but I expect that'll change soon. I've been following you all the way from the town. Cell 3's recent activity has given me rise to worry, and not just myself. I'll see to it that he reaches town without running into any trouble. As for you, I would like to ask you to get something for me. There is a sealed door in the library. You may have already ran across it. Behind that is a large repository. Do me a favor, bring to me any Dwemer books, schematics, or scrolls you find there, and by no means hand them over to Shanath. Any questions? You come off different from Shanaf and the others. Is that so? Probably because I'm against all this slaveholding nonsense. If it were up to me, I would free all the Noir. The citizens should learn to make a living some other way. I'll take my leave then. The repository holds all sorts of trinkets. You can keep them. When you have everything I need, remain in Sadrith Kegran. I will find you myself. Here's the key to the repository, and your code. My code? Seven, six, four, eight. I guess I can quickly check that place out. I swear to god, if I get attacked by something right now, I will not survive. I won't. I am too freaking weak for that. So here's to me hoping that nothing will attack me, because obviously, obviously, you have to be at a much higher level to do this mod. Oh gosh. I am not at that level. I don't know why I'm sneaking, but I feel like he might attack me and I don't want that. Okay, we're here. Wherever here is. Do I have to open these somehow? I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh. Seven, six, four, eight. Is that not the code? Seven, six, four, eight.
I don't know. <laughs> I have to go back there like it's showing me. <sighs> Sweet death awaits me. Maybe he won't reach me if I stand over here. Come over here. I'll burn you. Where is he? This is literally the only way I can possibly kill him. Well, uh, I'm doing some damage to him at least. As long as he doesn't somehow magically heal himself. You know? have anything that would let's see stamina magic or oh let's drink the wine <laughs> oh grape juice useful in a pinch when you're out of magic why dang am I weak At least I'll raise my magicka this way. There we go. But like, what does this do? No. Чё куре ёд крэнта сотвожёт? А это ту натэн надо ис. Ну гэрэ. Угу. Ну гэрэ. Well, anyway, I don't know how to figure this out, and this episode has been very long, so I will end it right here. I do hope you enjoyed this let's play. Uh, I'm enjoying playing this mod and whatever. So, please like and subscribe if you did. I would appreciate it a lot. Maybe follow me on my social media somewhere in the description or whatever. And yeah, I'll see you all in the next episode. Hope you have a great day and rest of the week. Goodbye.